Sup, John the Pikachu? Oh, I got a... Which is my comparison? Damn, the last time I did an RBA was before I had a 54 spiral. Pretty crazy. What's up, JJ? Congrats on your suit. Thanks for the geo. What's up, Sun Drunk? Remember the route. This is the same route as any percent without click clock literally. Except for tokens. Kinda. Actually no, I'm gonna get the token anyways. Forgetting where I have to pick these hearts. I missed. <laughs> Alright. I killed both of them, that's all that matters. What the? He's never been right fucking there. Hello? I was literally right in the way. Damn, this never happened to me before. Might have happened once. It's very un uncommon. Dude, can you just not? What's up, Moomar? Ha <laughs> 
it's, it is a real pace. What's up, Cardell? Gotta go wide. That was close. I decided to do this category today. I have the What's up, Marzi? I will try my best. Don't die. But I'm doing all the tricks. I practiced B just early, like for an hour, a couple days ago. Because 8-Bit said it would be a good idea to do it for a race in the marathon. And I really wanted to like apply it to something. <laughs> seven. Gotta give you something to work for. World record for you is too easy right now, and you're not even doing the hardest route. I don't even know if I'm gonna beat 8-Bit's time, honestly. Because I'm not good at BGS early. And I am doing BGS early. I refuse to do Caudel stuff right. But I'm just kidding. I, I really just wanted to... Uh, I really had like an itch to just, just do other categories. Like, I've been doing for the past couple weeks those meme categories. Save 2D, no camera change, um, the Xbox run. I'm gonna get that. Sub 110. Probably, but with B just early. Oh, this is not right. B just early, I don't expect it really. I kind of expect it, but like. I expect to fail B just early a lot. What's up, Ansgam? Alright, see ya, Ansgam. Good knowing you. Also, I'm not really touching routing much. I'm just pretty much copying what 8-Bit did, except for tokens. Tokens I'm doing a tiny bit differently. I had an urge to, like, time a few things, but I just didn't want to. I just wanted to run the category. What's up, Bob Rab? Thanks for the raid. How was your stream? What were you doing? Fifteen minute power nap. Oh boy. Oh, I gotta just I need that token. Oh. Going pretty decent. Usually I do any percent for this category, but I'm taking a small break just because I have an itch. I have a like really strong itch to do some other stuff, but I know that any percent, my goal in any percent would take like still a while left. 
So I'm just doing like one day of a different category. Yeah, I put my input display back. I'm testing it out to see if it's fine. Just to, to, to keep for now. <laughs> I'm not doing it to spite you. If anything, it's a slight inspiration. I'll assure you now, Caudel, I feel like there's a lot of things for you to time if, when you when you start doing this route. Tokens are the big one. I feel like ape does a lot of weird token routes that don't make sense at all. <laughs> Hey, Ape doesn't get MMM early or Click Lockwood early for trying his PB. Uh, he, like. Oh my fucking god, dude. That's beautiful. He does a bit of banjo whenever he feels like a random spark of motivation. But in general, he, he's like teaching these days. He has a job. I don't think he has much time. Last time he ran a banjo category was when he thought of the idea of the category extension uh, R RBA RTA. Then he just did that one night. I'm just gonna get a bubble here because I don't feel safe. way right If it skips this last note, I'm definitely not going to skip that. Because the cycle he tries to make without that note is like the cycle I usually try to make in any percent with that note. But it does... Give me an idea. It might be worth skipping two notes on the tail in order to maybe make that cycle. Like on the boat uh, for the bolt. Save you like a potential seven to eight seconds or something. But I don't think there's two other notes anywhere else in any percent that that are fast enough. I'm really early for this cycle. Damn it, I wanted to get this. Hmm. 
<laughs> that would make God L pull his hair out. It's funny. I actually remember Gogo critiquing 8 programming stuff when he was like doing algorithm stuff for big clips or whatever. Sorry if I don't use the right terms. I'm very, very ignorant on programming terminology. <laughs> Not like this. I'm so annoyed by that. Holy shit. <laughs> wow. Lost 20 seconds right there. I gotta switch my controller at this door. Ah, plug in the controller! Oh wow, I can't believe I did that right. <laughs> well, Ten, this is a different route completely. I get way less jiggies. Overall, I lost three cycles. No way, dude. I can't believe that. Holy shit, dude. I'm very, very lucky. Wow. Wait, I gotta hit this. I can't believe I just got that, dude. Wow! Oh, I gotta switch my controller. That's why this feels weird. Do it during the jiggy jig. Oh, wow. 
Maybe it does this order uh, tanked up then mud huts instead of mud huts then tanked up like the old route. I don't know why. I know in Sandcastle we do tanked up then mud huts, but in Sandcastle we do Blibbits or the timer jiggy. I don't know if he's timed it or not. It's something to keep in mind when I want to actually time stuff for this category. I think three health here is optimal, but I'm gonna get four. Just to be safe. up sunder Gogo, have you ever lost a world record to dog? I don't think so. I don't think you've ever been able to. Where am I going now? FP? Yeah. Yeah, but Caudel has like... Well, A, Caudel didn't say it, and B, Caudel has, like, a lot of other time losses that are easily, like, gainable for him, if that makes sense. A lot of other time saves that can easily make up for it.
I'm assuming it's slow caught L. I don't know if 8-bit got it, but generally it's a slow token. It's like 3 seconds. Why is it such a big gold? Oh yeah, because... Uh, yeah, never mind. I'm just assuming that I'll have more than enough by the time I get there. Uh, the pumpkin. I already got a couple extra that 8-bit didn't get. Fifteen when you death warp here? Okay, yeah, so I'm gonna have more than that. I'm gonna have one more than that, I believe. This token is also probably slow. I can't believe I remember how to do that. But that token helps me with my setup. It's the same speed, I think. I remember timing that one a long time ago to be 3 seconds, I believe. But I think the different movement we do now might make it less. Maybe. Not entirely sure. That's super unlikely, Sunder, just because of lag, thankfully. <laughs> Shed skip? I don't know. Not smart enough to find that. Actually, I took a damage leaving bubble loop. I almost forgot. Almost forgot. I need to get that health. That was close. Actually, a good FP. Like, legitimately, that was a good FP. It's not beating my real goal, though. Yeah, my PB. Well, yeah, my PB is done with zero bit clips. Yeah, my real goal there is like a 313, I believe. I don't know why I changed my camera there. I didn't need to. This camera's laggier. I think it drops all the way down to 20 FPS with that with this camera. Oh shoot, I forgot an MMM early split. I like completely forgot. And a click clock would early split. I only added a bubble group early split. That's my bad. Be 31 damage. FP is a really, really technical level. There's a couple of like really hard parts that takes a while to get consistent. Nope, 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 nope. I'm not gonna beat Buster here because I don't know the health management.
This is the hardest one for me. Dude, come on. Makes no sense. Yeah, it's not something you can really understand unless you like no speed running. <laughs> there are a lot of reverse engineering and spam. I definitely not me. Like I am definitely not one of the people who found it. I helped find a setup for Click Clockwood early, but like all the technical stuff was found by like it in Ring Rush kind of. I think mostly keep it though. I think Ring Rush is more has more fun the setups. Oh, I did split. Whoops, my bad. Gotta undo that. Well, what he did is he looked for where the actual clip was. And then reverse engineered it to like find out how to get close to it and how to like get to those specific spots. I have so many more tokens, really. I'm gonna have even more. Well, now I have <laughs> I actually have enough now. Like, I have enough to transform, so I have way more than enough. I definitely grabbed a ton of extra. But not many has been actually like that slow. Alright, I need the Jiggy here. I don't know how I remember remember how to do that, considering I haven't done that in a run since like I did any percent with only MMM early. <laughs> That's my bad. Yeah, you have way more health than you need in this level. I barely lost time. I'm bad at this game. Alright. <laughs> but GoGo, wasn't like the first MMM early setup found without a script though? I think it was, right? Or at least it was less automated, I think, right? No? But it definitely wasn't like the same exact program that Ring Rush uses now, right? 
feel like there's no way. <laughs> Less automated, yeah, okay. That makes sense. Oh, am I getting tokens? Whoops, my bad. <laughs> Muscle memory. <laughs> Yeah, less automated that 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 I expected. I hope I have enough jiggies by the end of this. I really do. Dang, that wasn't as big as a gold as it could have been. Actually, no, do you skip any- I don't skip any jiggies in MMM. Yeah. Never mind. In fact, my MMM itself was slower, I think. Because I got more tokens. All that time save was just from MMM early. Don't need the token. Alright, Gobi's Valley. Wait, I don't remember if it was faster to reset here. I don't think it is. Probably not. Uh, I don't know. I forgot what Podel did. Oh well. Not a big difference at all, I guess. To be fair, Gogo, that was like not that hard to recreate either. It's not like it was a pure chance of just randomly getting it. He did get lucky that he spawned out of like a specific loading zone that enabled that. But that's definitely easier than most big clicks. The puzzle load zone? What? Why are you screaming at me? Oh, I gotta open Gobies. Yeah. That was close. That was close. Thanks for yelling at me. <laughs> nah, 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 nah. I would have remembered. Maybe. What's up, Brandino? Thanks for the Jill, 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 Jill. Partial credit. But Sunder reminded me, not you. So Sunder gets partial credit if this world record's big if. Pretty sure it's faster to not get that last note right there, but I'm getting it anyways because I don't want to uh, risk having 10 or 8 or 9. It's also, you can do this with only one feather before the beak bomb. I'm also not going to risk that.
I haven't done that in months. <laughs> uh, no jiggies left, right? Wait, how many jiggies do I have overall? Yeah, wait, no, no jiggies left, right? No, I have to open RBB. Actually, I don't know. Can anyone look back and see how many jiggies I had after the Gobi's puzzle, please? That would really help. Oh, I suck. And tell me if that's enough to open RBB. I'm pretty sure I don't get any jiggies in this level. Oh, that was a zombie banjo glitch. Really cool. Well, okay, then I'm good. Thanks. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, no. Really? I feel- okay, okay, I know why that one feels, though. I jumped way too early. There we go. Double partial credit, sure, yeah. Give me that. Nice. Also, it's optimal to have four health here. <laughs> Excuse me, partial does not equal half. Thank you very much. <laughs> Best possible, get lower. I don't think it, it it won't go lower lower in Click Clock Wood, but it probably will go lower in RBB. Actually, it might go lower because of click clock order early, if I have a good click clock order early. Not by minutes. By like 30 seconds at most. But to be fair, Sunder, this is definitely not that much slower than any percent. Because like, Ape even had a theory that this could be the new any percent, just without RBA entirely. Oh, I should, oh, I, I need another health. Or I want another health. Should I get it? Yeah, I'm just gonna get it. I'm just gonna be safe. Or, yeah, I'm gonna get it. I don't know why I went for the farthest one. <laughs> But honestly, this is not even that bad of a run. I feel like I haven't made that many mistakes. Ooh, that was close. 
lot of small mistakes, but I don't think I've made many major mistakes. I know, right? This route was so cool when I saw 8-Bit do it. Dude, go up. Sup, garlic? Xbox Sandcastle, yeah, that one. Okay, that's my bad. <laughs> yes. Don't do that. Alright, at this point I'm just gonna break this. Careful! It does, yeah. I was surprised too, because you routed it out, but I've never timed it, so I don't know how long those notes are. What's up, Snowpy? Thanks for gifting a sub. Ten. Congrats on your sub. Oh wait, no, continuing your sub. Thanks for continuing the sub. I read that wrong. I've never seen that message before, that's weird. <laughs> okay. I don't know how I did that room because I haven't done that in months. <laughs> I didn't beat your gold, Caudel. Feels bad, man. I don't- wait, 
I don't do 640 skip, right? No. I'm right. I don't have to. <laughs> okay, 749. So how many notes do I need? 61. 61 and click clock. So make sure I have that much before I die. Or that many. Nope, not that one. Nice. That was really solid, actually. Oh, I don't split there. <laughs> Number the route. 61 notes. Dude, give me. I want it. Oh, I think I missed a lot of chat. I think my computer froze for a bit. I feel like I completely missed a lot of stuff. <laughs> oh. What's up, Prof? I would have done one day if I got record or not, which I'm not saying this is, because still anything can happen. Ooh, okay. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Did I choke this on purpose? The, the Caudel get record. I wanted to, at the worst, I just wanted to like, give him something a tiny bit harder to get, just to achieve record. I didn't want to make it like, extremely hard for him. <laughs> feel bad now. Don't touch me. Eighty percent for the inside. <laughs> Thanks.
Nice try, Birdie. I saw that coming. I'm not gonna gold feather this rock because I don't remember what gold feather management is like. One extra note. Yeah, eight. What eight bit did was um he skipped one note on the pole in Clanker's cavern, uh like the bolt jump pole, so he can make the extra cycle. But I get that note anyways. Just in normal any percent, and still make the same cycle. Alright, so it's looking looking like I'm gonna probably get a 104 if the rest goes okay. I think what this way. What I thought of doing was I think I was gonna um, Gotta know it's not a bad idea. I was thinking of removing the note. The last sand note in Gobi's. Like in the first speech section. That was my idea. I have tons of gold feathers. Yeah, both snare and mumbos. Yeah, yeah. I got that. I'm just gonna do what 8-bit does. I don't know what's the optimal fall route if you do it, but I know what 8-bit does in his route, so I'm just gonna copy that. I haven't timed anything. Three more notes? Okay, yeah. So yeah, 104 it's looking like. What's up, Stoozer? Thanks for the good luck and thanks for the raid. Are you doing a bug's life? Doesn't look like I can PB by 10 minutes, but we'll see. You were? How'd it, how'd it go? Sup, Dan? Dan, weren't you on my 1545 team like a year ago or something? I at least remember your name, I think. Unless that was a different Dan. Skip the text, please. Could have been a different Dan. Sup, DD Lux? You were? Okay, yeah, I knew it. I knew it. Bottles! It was terrible, damn. I feel that. Uh, 94. It was your fault we got last out, damn. I have bad, bad memory. I honestly don't even- I didn't even know that we came in last place until- well, I didn't remember that we came in last place. Sup, Arzio. Come on. Nice. Sup, Shemp. Be <laughs> prepared. <laughs> so normally I just do any percent of this game, because my goal is sub 1 in any percent. But I wanted to take a small break to do this category in Ancient Norba. Right now I'm on record pace. By like five minutes, I think. Nice. Dude, all the tricks went super well. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh no. <laughs> shit. 
了，我上了，上了。Go, go, go! Wait, what did you submit to, Gogo? -Go? Oh, the 1545 swap. That's a really cool idea, but I don't, don't really want to learn any other games right now. Ooh, I don't have any other consoles, so kind of hard to. Gonna submit BK. Oh boy, gonna be hard. Anyway. You're a decent grunty. DK? I kinda don't wanna do DK just because I've already have I already have like some experience with DK. Some. Very limited, but some. I've learned half of 101 and like half of 1%. Nice back to the idiot. <laughs> Alright. Is, is that supposed to be an entire marathon for the 1545? Damn it! I knew it. Dude, stop it. GG. 104.16. Nice. Back flipping the world record. Yeah. That's record. By how much? Five minutes and 20 seconds. I, was, I don't know if I want to do this again. Right now. I, I planned to just do a couple runs. Maybe get... Uh... Like a small PB or something. Not a small PB, but... I don't know. Yeah, I didn't think it would be that fast either. I really didn't. <laughs> so, okay, so for context. Just, just for context. So this category is any percent no RBA, so any percent without any B stuff. Um, a couple months ago, I had a record in this. It was a 114.05. And that was like pretty solidly ahead of everyone else. Mainly because it's not a super active category, although, although there's some people who run it. Uh, but yeah. But recently, I'm sure you guys have heard of MMM early. Bit clips have been found. MMM early has been found. Click Lock Wood early has been found. Um, Bubble Gloop Swamp early has been found. So overall, I'm saving like uh, 32 jiggies, I think, which is a lot of time. And I don't have to open MMM or Click Lock Wood. So I have, I'm saving a lot of time from that. And that's why I'm PBing by a lot. I did use BGS early, and it was crazy. I actually got it first try. I. 100 expected to fail BGS early, like, at least three times. I'm not good at it. Like, right now. Like, this would actually legitimately be hard for me to be right now, if I kept running. But yeah, that's your context. I just copied the route from the current record. Uh, the record, current record was from 8-Bit. The 8-Bit Beast. He made the route for this category that includes bit clips. I didn't route this prof, no, prof, uh, 8-bit did. 
And 8-Bit did like a couple runs, but his run wasn't that great. He failed the clips quite a bit and had some big mistakes. So yeah. Just for context. <laughs> Nope. That explanation was good enough. Alright, PG. Uh, I don't actually know what I want to do now. <laughs> Maybe I should just do normal 80% right now. Normal 80%? Should I? Pokemon Snap? Nah, I'm not. Nah, nah, nah. I'll pass on that. Dude, but the bit the bit clips actually went super well. <laughs> like second, well, dog isn't a bit clip, but all the tricks went well. Uh, BGS early was first try and was really fast. MMM early was first try and was pretty fast. Quick clock mode early was really fast. Dog skip was second try. <laughs> Crazy. I think. When I come back to this category, like, actually, for real, I think my goal would be a 102. I think. Don't quote me on that, but I think it might be 102. Which is really, really close to the timing of normal any percent. Because normal any percent right now is, like, around one hour long flat. I'm trying to go for sub one hour, but it's around an hour flat. This category would only be a couple minutes slower. <laughs> nice quote. Alright, anyway.